Hi guys! So today's video is going to be another DIY video because I love DIYs. I'm going to be showing you how to make a 50s waitress a uh, Halloween, that's the word that it is, Halloween costume tutorial because I love Halloween guys and I am so excited because you get candy, you get to look all cutesy in your little outfits and remember to make them modest because modest is hottest, that's what I always say. And yeah, so I hope you like this video. Remember to like and subscribe and leave any other video suggestions down below. And if you want more Halloween tutorials, let me know because I want to make videos you guys want to see. So let's get started. So first you're just going to need a blue skirt and you're going to need a blue polo and a kid sized apron. You can get them at Michael's. Some frilly black fabric, some socks with some lace on them, and some in and out burger hats, and some glue, fabric glue, and some scissors, and some white printer paper. So what you're going to do first is take your frilly black little border fabric, you're just going to unroll it, I barely had any left, and you're going to take your apron, and you're just going to put some of that adhesive on there. Did I just say adhesive? Well, I guess we're using proper terms now. And okay, so you put your fabric glue on the border of your apron. And once you've done that, you're just going to place your black frilly fabric on that part that has the glue. And you're just going to do that all the way around so that you can have it all the way around the apron. And then once you've done that, you're just going to cut off any excess and this is what it should look like from the back and then once it's dry it should look like this and it looks like it has a little border so to make your hat you are just going to get your in and out burger hat and you're going to cut a piece of white paper in half and you're going to put those two pieces on top because one is kind of see-through so you kind of need two so you're going to get two pieces and you're just going to put them on top and then you're going to cut off any excess that you have so i'm just doing that right here and then once you have cut off all of that excess you are good to go and you can tape those two pieces together and oh yeah guys you need some tape I forgot to show that but you know you need some tape gotta have that so you just tape those two pieces together and I just put a piece of tape on each end and then once you have taped those two pieces together you're going to tape them to your in and out burger hat so that you can cover that in and out burger logo because no one wants to be an in and out burger worker for Halloween. It is not cute. You just look like you missed your shift at work. So we're just going to cover that up so we can skip all of that shenanigans. And then once you've taped it onto both sides, it should look a little something like this. And this is what it looks like standing up. So it's just plain. And this is what your overall outfit should look like, and that's me dancing because, you know, I'm such a cool kid. So this is just a really conservative and cute and really quick and easy outfit to make. So for shoes, I just went with some light blue or navy blue, that's the color, Converse, and my little socks. And here is your completed apron and the rest of the ensemble. And you got your little hat so you can look like a waiter. And if you don't want to do the hat, you could always just put your hair in a ponytail and throw a bow in there. Since, you know, in the 1950s, they liked to put their hair in ponytails and have bows, apparently. So here's just a close-up of that. And you are good to go. You can go be a waitress. Thank you. 